And welcome back to another episode of Hippy Dippy. So now we're going into the main story. It's 14 years later. Special militia office. As it goes completely black. Cannon is still here. Does he get to be played main? Congratulations, Cannon. This brings our total loss count to 127. I'd say that's a new record. <laughs> so does we get to use Kanan in the third game? I remember he... the first time as if it was yesterday. My son was born the next day. How old is he now? He starts junior high next month. I see. It's it's got to be that shadow. I mean, think about it. Its influence uh, severs yeah. your data link every time. If we only knew what it was, then we could access the data he gave you. He Kana, does have a it's point. It's a summons from Representative Helmer. Could you Who the hell is Helmer? These results while you're there. I'm not your secretary, you know. No oh, shots fired! But today is my son's birthday. He's got a soft spot for us. Okay. So can we ha- well, Okay, so we know what the hell this guy is. The graphics I have see. gone up a little bit. That's unfortunate, but I suppose it can't be helped. I understand that it's data concerning the Milshan conflict. Is it really that important? Yes, it is. The truth behind the conflict lies buried within it. Okay. Hmm. The one who entrusted that data to you was a subordinate under my command. I had sent him in on an independent investigation. Yes, Jin Uzuki. Whatever happened to him? I thought you were a model with suppressed emotions. Don't tell me you're concerned about him. I'm just curious. He is the one who saddled me with this nuisance after all. <laughs> Don't worry about him. He's left the military. I hear he's doing fine. Oh, so he's not live. Now, I have another job I'd like you to undertake. You would like to suck my have dick. Look at this. The 100 series reality and problem. Oh, Momo! Momo! I'll be executing a dive into her subconscious domain at the Oh, yeah, this period. fucking part. Ah. What's the timeline? I've been notified that our people have just now descended from orbit and landed at the spaceport. I'd be obliged if you could go and pick them up. <sighs> Sounds to me like there's more to it than that. <sighs> We've noticed a rise in recent activity from both the UTIC organization and the immigrant fleet. I think in times like these, it pays to take precaution. Understood. Okay, so apparently the models in this game are a lot more updated and more crisp than the first game. Because the first game, Momo did not look like that. So now we get to find out what the hell happened to our crew here. But apparently we have more cutscenes to deal with. Because this game looks like... Ooh, who the hell is this bitch? She's got massive fucking boobs. Your Holiness. I oh, God. Concerning the matter of the Y data. Chief Inquisitor Margulis wishes wait, to... Wait, wait, wait. Details Can I... Directly. I can I ask you a fucking question? Are we going after a fucking church now? What the fuck? Whatever. Well, of course it's a, it is a church. Because she's got a fucking cross on her neck! Oh, she, we probably have to kill her too. A bunch of fucking idiots. You think they didn't know shit? This guy's evil already. You can tell by his fucking eyes. <laughs> Oh, he is evil because of this jackass! Your Eminence, it is an honor to be in your presence. 
Spare me your platitudes. I understand that the Realian in possession of the Y data has fallen into the hands of the Kukai Foundation. I trust you have an explanation for this? Yes, Holiness. It is true that the 100 series prototype that holds the Y data is currently in the custody of the Kukai Foundation. Good point. Or rather, the second Milshan government. However... I trust you understand the significance of the situation. According to the URTV Albedo, the Y data is secured by a form of high-level protection. Only accessible at the UMN Control Center on 2nd Milsha. Hence, the current situation. Preparations for our next move are already underway. Margulis. I've heard that the recent offensive against 2nd Milsha was the result of Cardinal Heinlein's manipulation of the Federation's military's upper ranks. What do you know of this? I am afraid I possess no intimate details of that. I would presume that all of the Cardinal's decisions are made in the organization's best interest. Your words. Your I words? I'll give you my words! It says the little finger, asshole! <laughs> Put me off the TV as we speak, bitch! I would never allow myself to be manipulated by ancient dogma. So who's the final boss? I think he's the final boss at some point. Our fleet is considering an invasion of the demilitarized zone in the near future. Maybe you're an idiot. I sincerely hope that you will not disappoint me. I understand, Your Holiness. I vow to deliver you good. So we are going after holiness. a church. Holiness. A religious fucking cult. I don't like that you are TV. It reminds me of someone, someone vulgar. Who? Be sure you remember that. As you wish. Kill him! These guys are a bunch of fucking church assholes. This is why religious kills people, man. If you're religious, I respect it, but you know. This is what happens! <laughs> people are trying to kill each other! <laughs> they get suspicious when they get old. <laughs> oh, he's got his eye back. The weaker they are. The louder they bark. She's hot. Pellegri, what's your status? Everything is proceeding smoothly. I have Herman and Richard pursuing the target as we speak. As this is an independent Inquisitor operation, I'm granting you permission to use the ES Issachar. ES? You mean those thousand-year-old relics? Do they still work? The ES is equipped with the Vessel of Anima. The Vessel of Anima. The Vessel of Anima was discovered at the same time as the Zohar. Its power rivals the military might of an entire star system. Okay. Handle it with care. How about no? Afford for it to get damaged. Why? Oh my god, it's like 59 fucking minutes and we haven't done anything! I, like I'm, I feel like I'm watching a fucking movie where the main villains can be a dialogue that makes no fucking sense because I forgot what happened in the last game! Because it's been a fucking year since I played that! Thank you! R&D report. File number... She is back! 6643. Okay, so everyone gets a model. Everyone gets a different model. Field testing on board the Federation cruiser Woglinde awoke during a Gnosis attack on the fleet. She initiated autonomous mode, even though that mode was still sealed and has been fully operational ever since. You see, Momo is different. She's not like an alien. She looks more of like a human. 
And Ziggy still looks the same though, although he looks like he's more pissed off. After the Cosmos is- we already know what Cosmos looks like because of what happened in the first cutscene. We are presently descending- well, Junior looks like more of a robot- KICK HIS ASS! Cosmos over to Vector's second R&D division. Furthermore, while en route to Milsha, we took the 100 series- Oh, how did you fucking screw up?! <laughs> During this time- <laughs> Kick his ass, Shinon! Woo! Get the boxing gloves! Oh yeah, that's right. Okay. <laughs> about the appearance of the Song of Nephilim and Proto Merkaba. Cosmos' actions allowed us to overcome these. So Cosmos doesn't have her fucking thing on the bottom. The actions by Cosmos has been greatly influenced by her black box components left behind by the late Kevin Winnicott. This will likely become a major focus of our future research. Report author, Shion Izuki, Chief Engineer. Cosmos Development Project General Operations, Vector Industries, 1st R&D Division. Uh -huh. And we haven't done anything lately. We're just... Alright, so here's the deal. Okay, there are a lot of side quest missions in this section. And you have to do them before you get to the next cutscene. So we're going to be doing those things ah, next. It's so good to be alive. Yeah, yeah, no kidding. For a while there, I was kind of worried. But Junior doesn't look, look like back. a fucking robot. His eyes are better. I'm telling you, the crazy stuff the chief pulls always keeps me on edge. Kick his ass! What are you saying? You make it sound like it was all my fault. Oh, uh, that's not what I meant. I, uh... Hey, Cosmos! Thank goodness you were there. Man, you really saved us. Alan's not getting Thank fucker for Alan's not getting fucking fuck... Getting the fuck she on. He's not getting in her pants anytime soon because he keeps digging himself into a grave. <laughs> Alice, I told you this in the first game. Alan is a fucking tool. He has no fucking balls whatsoever. <laughs> I am happy to be of service. <laughs> Although Shia looks pretty badass in this. I like this. Shia. Hmm. Cosmos looks better with her hair like this because it's a lot. Cosmos. Yes. I think I'll wander over to Vector's second division. Is that all right with you, Cosmos? Acknowledged. That will not be a problem. I see. Well, I guess you gotta do your job. You're gonna be here for a little while, right? Hey, maybe we can have some fun later. That'd be great. I'll show you around this place, Momo. Thanks. I'm looking forward to it. She, did she, I... All right, then. Shall we, Cosmos? Please excuse us. Goodbye. Who do we get to play against? Oh yeah, we're not- we what get- the... Hey, Chief! Wait up! <laughs> I suppose we should get going too. Sorry. Could you wait just a little while? I'm going to report what's happened to the subcommittee. It appears that Dr. Miss Rahi has also arrived at Milsha as well, if you have a message for her. Really? Mommy's here? Mom of the year, yes. people! Sent her kid to get kidnapped and then... I'm looking forward to seeing her. And she's not. Got it. I'll pass it along. I like to say this, the game, the facial structure of this game, you can tell that they did a lot better when it comes to the models of the characters in this game than in the first game, because they look a lot more crisp and a lot more human-sized like, unlike the last game, they look like more digital. Continue your assignment until the delivery is complete. Acknowledged. Dr. Mizrahi. Yes, Jan Sauer. Is there something else? I am currently Ziggurat 8. 
so it appears. Momo is looking forward to seeing you. I see. I... I too welcome your arrival. Rom of the year! You know, yeah. it almost sounds like she's scared to meet her. Eavesdropping is not a very admirable pastime. Well, he's junior. He can do it. Hey, old man, how about upgrading to a modern carbon-based body? I bet. If we applied combat realian technology, we'd see some serious results. There's no need to play around with extending my lifespan. Sure about that? I bet Momo would be happy if you live longer. I'll pass, thanks. I have no desire to prolong things. <sighs> All right. What did Ziggy Man? You know who to call if you ever change your mind. Who is Ziggy Man? I forget what he did. Because I know he has a bad past. I keep forgetting it. So who are we controlling? Shion's group? Or the Chaos and Momos? Yeah, well, shall we read your go read your the others? Cause the key man of super fuck you, yo, yo, yo. Sorry, I can't help it. I love the music in this game. Oh, he's level eight. Nice. That was 17 minutes of fucking cutscenes, man. Fuck! <laughs> I just realized that, man. What the fuck? Okay, so where we're so where the the crew, man? Wait, wasn't Junior with us <laughs> like a few minutes ago? What the fuck? So where the we are wait a There's your mill. All right. She seemed very busy. Oh, I knew it. She's one of the contact subcommittee's head members. I'm sure it's a demanding role. Yeah, I guess you're right. I guess I've got to do my best to help her out. I feel like I'm just watching a movie and commentating over it. That's all it is. Like, we're in a car now, like... Ah! What the... An ambush? <sighs> what the fuck is going on?! Junior, who are they? Albedo? No, it's not him. It's too gentle for him.
Damn, but look at fucking drive! Holy shit! She's a fucking bad man! She must have played fucking st Oh, what's it called? That fucking Fast and the Furious? Man, she can fucking drift too! Holy shit! Junior, your guns are not gonna do shit! Oh shit. She's fucking nuts! <laughs> Alright! We made it! You're safe. ba bing bing ba doo Shit's gonna touch! Ah, oh, the music cut out. <laughs> that is fucking intense. Holy shit. They're right behind us. Okay, we'll head from 4.289 the roof, Sakamoto System 6. Oh, good thinking. That way the citizens won't get caught in the middle. Let's go. Damn, man, shit's gone real. Nice job. Alright, I'm gonna save it. Not on that one, because I want to talk to all the PCs off camera. But this is where you get the train. You get, you can tell. Um, oh yeah, before we start anything, um, skills. But yeah, you can tell that they did a lot of fucking upgrades when it comes to the facial structures, and I really appreciate because their eyes are not as big anymore. And they look like more like humans. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's see here. Memory, and what we'll do this one? Alright. Uh, 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 let's see. Alright. Yeah, you have to get all of them on camera. Wait, what the hell? With their spear, heavy guard. We want heavy guard. There we go. I'm so used to this one. Alright, we want. No. Yeah, this was a lot easier. I do have to teach them all this stuff. Um, Ah, I should have the medical off. Oh, well. that's fine. Oh, he can use it too. I don't like using um. Uh... Yeah, this place is a lot. I like the system of this game. I haven't done Ziggy Man yet. Level 3 is where it gets interesting. Down the fence now. No, what's the fence? Hold on. Yeah. 
We want Defender. You know why I'm very used to this game and why it's so much easier for me? I uh, the last game is because I'm used to playing this game more than any other Zeal Saga game. That's why I think I'm very customized with this game. Miracle Star, um, Ether Spear. Let's you know, let's give him F. I don't usually use Ziggy, but this game reach. Combat, combat, re secure. Yeah, Ziggy Man, I don't really use that much. Okay, um, let's see, Ether. The music in this game is awesome. To be honest with you, it's really awesome. I re All right. So now we got our main cast. Pretty oh, whoa! Why are you doing this? Okay, so Cosmo, so she's got a bow and arrow now. She's got a bow and arrow now. What was her fucking first game? Uh, she didn't have bow and arrow in the first game, I don't believe. Of course, Junior still has his fucking pistols. And we already know what Chaos can do. I feel more like a combat model these days. Oh, that's something different. So, she's got a bow and arrow. What was she do? What did she do? She did not have a bow and arrow the last time, so that's really interesting. I think that's really interesting, to be honest with you. So, they changed Momo's fucking... Model, but we're gonna change the party here as I press the wrong fucking button. See, Zeno Saga's battle mechanics. We're gonna switch Cosmos with Ziggy Man. Oh, he doesn't use his guns anymore, he just kicks it. No, I want to pause it. Why the hell do I want to pause it? Oh, <laughs> well, we have to go this way. Well, we can go that way, but we can also go this way, too. Okay, so that's where we're supposed to go. Ah, that's where we got that. Sweet. Alright, so... Oh, they're... They, she does... So they do fucking thingamabobbers. Well, now we're getting now we're getting into fucking bullshit. Um, so we're we are now into the fucking meat of things. But I hope you guys have a nice, positive day. Take care. And Zeno Saga is gonna be the main focal point for the rest of for the rest of the winter. And excuse me, probably part of the mostly part of the spring too. So I love Zeno Saga too. It's my favorite fucking game because of the fucking music's fucking 
dope as shit. I love the fucking music in Xenosaga 2. Especially Labyrinthos. I I had that on my MP3 player when there was MP3 players still around. <laughs> I feel fucking old! <laughs> but yeah, hope you guys have a nice boss in them day. And take care, man. I love this game, man. I can play this game for fucking hours. I like the first game. The first game, I didn't really like it that much. I like this game more than the, the other game. However, if I got uh, everyone their swimsuits, I could have probably transfer all the swimsuits on here. Just like I did with the other game. But I'm probably not going to do this time. I will, however, show off all the missions. I hope, if I remember correctly. But that's going to make the game a lot longer. Because the story is not that very long, to be honest with you. Because I know at my speed, I will be grinding off camera as well. So I just want to let you guys know that. Um, I will show off every cutscene like I normally do. But I hope you guys have a nice, positive day. And take fucking care, bitches!